Hi, Danielle here. Welcome to my channel, Danielle's Corner. Today we're going to be discussing different ways to say no to people. Okay, so I don't know if any of you all are like I am, but I am a pleaser. I want to please people, you know, um, so I do have a difficult time saying no. I like don't want people to get upset with me. I don't want to hurt people's feelings. I'm just, that's just how I am. It's, I have worked on this for a long time <laughs> and it is hard for me to, um, to say no still. I have gotten better. You know, the simple fact of the matter is you don't owe anybody an explanation. If you're not able to do something, if you don't want to do something, just say no. I've learned that because also I used to say no and then like think of an excuse. But then what happens is that person, if they really want you to do something for them or with them, they'll come back with, well, what about when, you know, what about after you're done with that? What about this? What about that? So I've just learned that if either I don't want to do something or I'm not able to do something, I'll just say no, plain and simple. I don't know, you don't owe anybody an explanation as to why you're not able to or you don't want to. You know, I don't want to go to dinner tomorrow night. I'm not able to go to dinner tomorrow night. I don't know why it matters. I'm just not going to, you know, so, and you don't have to be rude about it. I'm not being like, you know, no, I'm not going. Like, no, absolutely not, you know, but you know, sometimes you have a full plate or you've had a full plate and you were looking forward to just staying home. You don't, you have that right. It's, you don't have to do what other people want you to do. You know, of course you can also, if let's say you were going to go to, you, um, they did, a, you did get invited to go to dinner and you don't want to, but like, I don't want to go tomorrow, but how about if we plan it for next weekend? Because by then my project or anything for work will be done and I'll have had time to kind of decompress and then we can plan on it. You know, so you can even do that. It's just that day doesn't work. Or maybe it's something that somebody wants you to do that you just absolutely do not want to do. Just say no. You don't owe them anybody an explanation, whether it's a family member, um, a friend, um, whoever, a coworker, you don't owe anybody an explanation. So just always remember that, you know, um, like I say, you don't have to be rude about it. You don't have to be mean about it, but just say no, no explanation, no anything like that. Also, you don't need to apologize either. So a lot of times what I would do, I'd be like, oh, I'm sorry. I'm not going to be able to make it. I don't need to apologize. Like, I mean, you can, but don't feel the need to, you know, because that just kind of makes it see, I don't know. It's just not good. Um, just, you know, I'm, you can say, I'm sorry, I'm not going to be able to make it. You can, but, um, you don't have to like apologize, I guess is what I mean. You can word it like that. Oh shoot. I'm sorry. I won't be able to make it tomorrow. Okay. But you don't have to be like, I'm so sorry. I'm not going to be able to make it. I'm so sorry. I hope that it doesn't mess everything up for you. Um, eh, I'm, I'm sorry. I mean, you don't have to do it like that. I mean, you might be sorry. I'm sorry I can't make it, you know. But you don't have to, like, grovel at somebody's feet because you're not able to make it to dinner or to uh, whatever it is, you know. You're just not going to make it. Um, so those are things that I've learned that kind of work for me, you know. No explanation. Don't be groveling and feeling bad. And don't feel bad either. Like, you don't, just because you're not wanting to go do something or not able to go do something or whatever it is, you don't have to feel bad. I mean, I still struggle with that. Even even with, like, my daughters, you know, if they want me to do something, I'm like, ugh, I really don't want to, you know, even if it's just, like, whatever, you know. I still struggle with that. I, I have the hardest time saying no. I struggle with it and I might even like my daughters of course are more open so I'll be like oh I might like kind of snap at them or something because they're bugging me and I just I don't say no so it's still something I struggle with I'm still working on it um I've gotten better with like other people but with my daughters <laughs> for some reason I have the hardest time I just want them I the reason is because I just want them to be happy. And what I have had to realize is me saying no to something doesn't mean they're not going to be happy. 
So I said, no, you know, like, like now we've been like inside a lot and Shine will be like, oh, do you want to watch something now? And even if I don't want to, a lot of times I'll say yes. And then she's like, you can say no, mom, you don't have to, or you can finish what you're doing. And then we can do that. So, you know, they know me well enough to know when I <laughs> don't want to do something and they kind of, you know, let me off the hook per se. But yeah, so I still struggle with it. I'll probably struggle with it for a long time because that's just who I am and that's fine. It's something that I work on. We all have things that we're working on all the time and that's okay. That's okay. You know, we're always just trying to better ourselves. That's what, that's what we're here for is to help each other and get better. And, um, you know, we will, we do a little bit at a time. We might have the things that we struggle with, but that's okay. That's okay. Um, I hope you guys like this video. Click the like button. Consider subscribing if you haven't already. Um, leave a comment below. Let me know what works for you. Let me know if you've used any of these these tools or maybe what you do use that maybe I maybe can help me out because obviously I still struggle with that. And um, I hope you all are having an amazingly blessed day and an amazingly blessed week. And I'll see you all in my next video. Bye.